Nashville, Tennessee getting ready to go to Summer Nam. And this is the view I have every morning when I get up and when I take my coffee. Look at that. That's an amazing view. I'm staying at my good friend Lidge Shaw's place. He was kind enough to let us stay here, me and Jesse, my wife. Uh, this time I didn't come alone, so I was lucky enough to bring my wife with me. She helps me out with the business. I'm gonna get ready, jump in the car, go downtown, get my badge, and go to Summer Nam 2018. Here we are, Summer Nam. Got my badge, ready to get in. Another cool thing about Madness is to meet people like this. Hey everybody, how's it going? Hanging here in Nashville, Tennessee at Summer Nam with oh, this yeah. incredibly awesome extra wide lens. It's pretty <laughs> wide though. It's that impressive. Is, that is pretty wide. That is Guy. <laughs> Guess what that I, is? I'm very envious of the beers. That, you know everybody's jealous, you know? Even yeah. Joel Gilder told me the same thing. So you're trying to grow a beer like mine, eh? I'm close. Look, look, see? If you go like this, it's the same. Almost. I think Joe and I are probably both married to very similar women that are like, you're not growing a beer. That's the thing, eh? Yeah, so, I'm you, so you, have, it's, you have to have your wife on camera here, so you allow, <laughs> you allow him to have the beard. There yeah. you go. Yes, ah, you see. Thanks to her. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm a lucky guy, I guess. My wife is not a beard person. There you go. So, hey, happy to see you here, at Warren. It's fun. It's so cool, man. It's a, how, what, do you, what do you think I've done so far? It's the first date. So. It's really good. I mean, yeah, first date so far. I mean, I've only seen a handful of yeah. things. Uh, BAE have a new pedal called Royal Tone, which looks amazing. And I watched somebody do a, a video the other day, but I haven't played it myself. That looks good. I actually think the most exciting thing so far, and there's going to be more, obviously, because I'm only here a couple of hours, is PMC were like the, like the high-end speaker yeah. manufacturers, Spike Stead, you know, all of these, all of these great people. Uh, like some of the biggest mixes in the world seem to be using BMC, have brought out, and I know it's not cheap, but it's a lot cheaper. They brought out a pair of speakers for under $3,000. Okay. So I know that's a lot of money, but for a guy that's maybe in a small environment and yeah. wants to put on their studio list that they use PMC speakers just like all mm -hmm. the, the big boys, which are usually like eight grand, ten, twelve thousand yeah, exactly. dollars upwards. It's Can't good. Be worth it. And they're not doing like the cheap injection molded made in China, no disrespect because it's great China speakers. They're still making them in the same place in the UK. Okay, cool. And I went to listen to them and they sound amazing. Oh, nice. That's good to know. So, you know, if you're in that mid-price kind of range and you want the, 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 the best that, stuff. That could be a good option. Could be a good option. So that's the most exciting thing so far, but I've only been here a couple of hours. Yeah, so exactly. Same I here, know so. I'm going to see another ton of great things. Chances are you will. Yeah. <laughs> All right. And, th and this is my favorite now. Seriously? Yeah, because look, everybody here I know. is in the music industry. Everybody, you know, is here. It's really easy to get around. Trident, it is. Trident, I, they have an A range in Q. They have new consoles they're bringing out, which they're also building in California. Cool. So their quality levels are super high. And it's less walking for us. <laughs> it's less walking. We get to see all the good gear. Yeah, compared to the one in Anaheim. So. Yeah, and Nashville's really easy to get around. It is. And I brought my wife out. You brought your wife out. It's like. It's kind of you get out, you get to stay in a beautiful area yep. surrounded by trees. Yeah. And you get There's so good. many trees here, it's crazy. Yeah. So it's, it's like crazy. a beautiful place I with love great it. food. You're right. And everybody seems to be a musician. What? You know. How can you go wrong? Yeah, it's my fourth <laughs> year in a row. I love that's it. That's so cool. It's my yeah. second on my side, but that's, yeah. nice. that's nice. great. Hey, great. Great right. seeing you, man. Great seeing you too. Take care. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you. Green. Green. Yes. 
All right, so there you go, guys. I'm with Ryan from Creative Lab. Sound Lab, Creative Sound Lab. Creative Sound Lab. All right, guys, I'm with Ryan from Creative Lab. You suck. <laughs> so hot. Creative Sound Lab. Creative Sound Lab. I am with Ryan from Creative Sound Lab. Amazing YouTube channel. You guys have to check it out. I'm going to leave the link down below. So, uh, Ryan, your first time here at Summer Nam. Your thoughts so far? Uh, it's really cool. Um, you know, I, I love gear, and it's really cool to see the people behind that gear. Yeah. Because you don't always see that. And it's cool to see the passion of the makers of this gear, kind of their story, kind of their angle on the stuff. It's really cool to build relationships and also see yeah. see what's uh, you know what's new in the market. So. Yeah, definitely. That's cool. You know, uh, I've been following your channel for at least a year, year and a half, and so I was I was pretty uh, happy to see you here in Nashville. Thanks, man. So it's, it's nice to meet you, and hopefully we'll do this again. Yeah. All right, man. So don't forget to check his channel. He's good. Now one of the best part of NAM is meeting guys like this one. This yeah, guy, yeah, like, yeah. come on, that's great. It's only the alcohol that makes him think that. I love that. There you go. So just because of him, okay. I can manage to have my beer here at NAM. Very good. Very good. And wine. And wine too. That's the thing with walking in Nashville. You get to hear all sorts of music. There's always music playing somewhere, Russell. What? What did I do wrong now? <laughs> <laughs> I was just saying that there's always music playing somewhere. Yes. When you walk in Nashville. Yes, I agree. It's the Taylor Swift Education Center. You can learn something about Taylor Swift and education. <laughs> So that was my last day here at NAM. It went pretty, pretty well. So let's get out of here. Yeah, very happy I came. Always good to meet friends and new friends. That was pretty cool. So I'm looking forward for the next one, maybe AES in the fall in October and looking forward for the next winter NAM. So that was summer NAM 2018 here in Nashville. So I'll see you guys around.